Omaha has been working for nearly three years on creating an action and resilience plan to address climate change. And tonight was the first of four public open houses to address the issue. Our Bella Crockett is on your side with how your comments and considerations can make it into the plan. John Aaron, data analysis has been going on for the past year to establish baseline information and identify vulnerabilities and potential areas of improvement. While it may look like a lot of the legwork is done, city planners and consultants assure people their comments will be taken into consideration and could even make it onto the final draft. Uh, so really we're, we're talking about beginning a long-term journey. It's a living project, one that continues to be changing, officials say. The Omaha Climate Action and Resilience Plan is now in the drafting stage, with the long-term goal to be climate ready, resilient, and carbon neutral by 2050. It's an initiative City Council President Pete Festerson is proud of, and he hopes you take part in the process. So ultimately, it'll be the community that implements it in coming years. The city hired consultant identified preliminary goals across eight areas the city could work on to reduce emissions, including targets that fall under transportation, building energy use, and waste management. But they're not set in stone. For example, officials say multiple comments at the first virtual meeting made about curbside composting are resulting in consideration for the next draft. Due to the interest that we've had from the public in composting, I can see that uh, it, there would be some real value to, to uh, pursuing some kind of composting program. We'll see how that develops as this plan moves forward. Another comment asked about the plan promoting or subsidizing energy saving measures for renters and homeowners. Those are really uh, great specific ideas that you've got. We'd love to, uh, to have them, so please share them on the form if you're able to. That would be fantastic. Nearly 60 people logged in and most of them stayed for questions. Official said input will be summarized, put together, and provided to the planning team. That'll be in the midst of their process as they're refining and considering direct action. You can find the information on the other three in-person public houses on our website at WOWT.com. Live in the newsroom, live in the studio, Bella Caracta, 6 News.